Oh. <laughs> not uh, not too bad for the second day of October. What do we got here? My my two wheel drive, four wheel drive is uh, snowed in. Well, how much snow uh, since I got to work? There you go. Damn near eight inches just since I got uh, just since I got to work. So, uh, if you've been following my truck videos, you definitely know that we can pretend to have four-wheel drive, but we definitely do not. Uh, great high visibility way to drive around because your windshield wipers are all frigged up. This one's backwards. <laughs> Frick! Okay, no more coming undone. That one, uh, that one over there is zip tied together. <laughs> you can go ahead and comment on my, uh, my Hutterite beard. That's fine. My neck beard is coming in muy guapo. Thank you uh, very much. Eight inches of snow here and only more on the way. If um, there happens to be snow around on the weekend, it's Thanksgiving here in Canada. Yes. Welcome to Thanksgiving in Canada um, in October. If there is still snow on the weekend, I think uh, maybe what I should do is break out the phaser this weekend at least and uh, I don't know, put some tracks in. How about that? How does that sound? Maybe I'll even uh, get around to installing my drive shaft for this truck this weekend because driving a two-wheel drive truck in the snow is probably the worst thing that you can do. It is freaking bright out. People are putting tracks on the ground in Revelstoke. I mean, they probably have about as much snow as we have here up at the cabin right now but uh, you know what it's starting to happen oh and uh shout out to my uh colorado squad fam a guten tag everything i know about colorado is from south park <laughs> that's just how us sledders are you know we get all fired up when we see uh, a little bit of snow or in this case quite a bit of snow for this early in the year sometimes we go through halloween and it being uh brown early october here already nice and white Will it stick around? Probably not, but eh, who knows, maybe it will. Gonna be doing some mods to the M8 coming up here. I have all the parts that I need to do the headlight delete kit. Uh, that's something I did on my 2017 a few years back. Uh, so I'm gonna be doing that to my 14 this year because I know a ton of people have been asking me for the part numbers and I just, I haven't, I, I cannot be bothered to look up part numbers. I'm gonna be doing that finally. So I, I got all the parts I need to be doing that. I'm gonna be doing that here. Uh, coming up maybe this maybe I'll start this weekend or next weekend get that thing all well no I can't start next weekend because next week's in the sled show so I'll be busy uh yeah we'll be up there on Saturday in Edmonton just hanging around the show uh go see our old friends go meet new ones of course but yeah I've got uh, all the parts I need for the M8 coming up right away here uh I think they're all in my toolbox actually I don't think I'm missing anything to do it everything I need to um, so I know there's been lots of people like I say there's been lots of people who are asking me about that and I finally will be doing that and I'll actually do a whole how-to video and show you how to do that headlight delete kit um, it's no there's no kit for it well there's no good kit like I said when I uh, when I first started doing that mod uh, I couldn't find a kit that I liked so Basically, I just ended up making my own, and I'll show you how to do that. And then the best thing about the way I do it is that everything is completely 100% reversible. So if you find you don't like it, you can go back to stock. Uh, you, there's no cutting or anything like that. There's a few optional things you can do that I'll show you. I didn't do them um, on my Mountain Cat 2017. I didn't feel the need to. People, people watch my video, and they said... Oh, it's bogging. It's, I'll, I'll tell you that. That sled, that 2017 Mountain Cat I had, that sled was not bogging. That sled was running like, that sled was running tip top. That sled never bogged on me once. But, I mean, everybody on YouTube thinks they're a mechanic, right? Anyway, thanks everybody for watching this video. If you like this video, if you like this talk vlog, smash that like button down below. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Even if you have, hit the notification button. Uh, that's that little bell thing down there. I don't use it, but you should. Thanks everybody for watching. See you in the next
It is now four hours later. I'm done work and it's still snowing. Here are some of those parts we're doing the headlight delete kit on. For people have been waiting for it because I know there's been uh, quite a few. I'm, uh, waiting for that big dew cap of snow that's right up there to come down onto the windshield and my wife is going to hit the brakes. Let's try. Nope, it's going to be a surprise when it happens.